So you find yourself at the subway. Begin Again begins with Mark Ruffalo playing a washed up music exec. So what are we doing here? It's not working. You gotta go. I'm taking my client list. It's not Jerry Maguire. Kira Knightley, a heartbroken singer songwriter, and Adam Levine as her philandering superstar boyfriend. You're Dave Cole. Would you mind taking a photograph? I don't know what to say. I loved him like a fool. As for this interview, it began with Joelle. Joelle. Love her. Very kind words from a very kind cast I won't soon forget. I heard, and I don't know if this is true or not, that all musicians secretly want to be actors and all actors secretly want to be musicians. False, because Kira does not want to be a musician. <laughs> am, I, am I the one that's going against the rule? Because yes. I'm just like, no, yes, I don't are. want to do yes. that. She's, so good at it. she's got a velvet sweet. voice. A velvet voice. Yes, with, with a smudge <laughs> of bourbon on it. <laughs> you guys have been doing this all day. You want to go fun or do you want to go deep? Fun. Fun, okay. You want to play a little trivia? Please, yeah. God, fun. Okay. Yeah. Right. So yes. something that I love about what I get to do is not only do I get to see fabulous movies, but I get to learn something about my favorite actors and musicians. Let's see how well guys know each other. Okay. True or false, Adam has his own microphone-shaped fragrance available at Walmart. False? <laughs> I mean, I'm hoping that's true. Okay. No, it's all right. not true. Okay, okay, first of all, hold on. Time out, time out. No, 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 no. It's okay, dude. Okay. It's okay. It's great. Listen, no, it's so I want to tell a story about it's okay. so, That is so great. First of all, it's true, okay? It's true. I will tell you this about it. It's really good Hold on, you. whatever it is. Uh, I know, it's great. I, I actually love it. I smelled many different scents, and I actually had a lot to do with it. My band's like, do it. What are you crazy? Funny. Wow, nice. I'm expecting I said, okay. a double care pack package. It's good. You. It's not bad. True or false, Kiera asked for an agent when she was six. True. False. It false. was. It was three. <laughs> oh, that was a trick question. Okay, so true or false, Mark accidentally smoked marijuana while performing live on stage. Um, I'm gonna say, first of all, you don't accidentally smoke marijuana. <laughs> <laughs> Second of all, I'm gonna say, I hope that's true. Is that true? True. 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 Someone true. lays it. Yeah. I, had, I, had I had a joint that I was a prop, a prop joint, and yeah. somebody put a real put one a real in there. Mm -hmm. And literally, so we like smoked it down to a nub, which you never do. Yeah. And I have never been more <laughs> uh, high in my life. Yeah, I bet. And, I had, and that was wow. in the first yeah, 10 minutes of the play. Great. Yeah. <laughs> I was amazing. It was for during a play for you? <laughs> yes. A um, press night. For Dave Cole, would you mind taking a photograph? So something I loved in the beginning of the film, so you guys are going into your apartment and you get recognized for one of the first times. Do you remember the first time you ever got recognized and when you were excited about it? I have a great story. Okay. It's kind of post I have a good one. So I was, I was at a coffee shop and I was having coffee with my buddies and I had, it's just it's kind of gross the story, but I don't care. And I had to go to the bathroom and it wasn't number one. You know what I'm saying? It was number two. And I had to go and when I have to go, it doesn't matter where I am, I have to go. <laughs> And I went, like a normal person, if they're desperate for a, a bathroom. And then I went back to my seat and started to enjoy my coffee, you know? And this kid came out to me, <laughs> this is amazing. And this kid came out to me, probably about 16 years old. And I'm expecting at this point for it to be, I'm thinking, okay, I'm gonna so put my smile on, I'm doing it. Like, are you in Maroon 5? And I'm like, well, yes, I am, you know? Find your napkin or whatever. And you can see he's kind of <laughs> mustering the courage to say something that was kind of nasty. You know, he's getting himself pumped up yeah. and he goes, well, yeah, you cut me in line. I'm like, and I don't know what he's talking about at this point. I'm like, oh, sorry. And he goes, you took a sh oh, Wow. And it stinked. And it's people everywhere, right? And I'm like, I'm not gonna lie to you, I did, I did do that. Yeah. You know what I mean? I don't know what he wants me to say to him. And he yeah. was super mad. He's like, you think your sh don't stink? And I'm like, I'm thinking he's gonna ask me for an autograph, so I'm so <laughs> thrown off. And I'm just like, dude, I'm, so, I'm, so, I'm sorry, man. I'm finding myself apology to this kid. And then, I, then I'm kind of something else clicked in, and I was like, wait a minute, get out of here, man. I didn't, I didn't see you. I'm sorry. And everyone was hysterically laughing, and I'm just like, I was the most shocked I'd ever been because I really thought he was gonna be like. Big fan. He signed my CV, oh, and he really just <laughs> called me out yeah, on using a coffee bean bag. It was awful. That's I have to stop. Uh, I had so much time. I had another I'll tell game you next time. I just admitted that okay. to the entire.